All right. Hey there, hi there, hello there, hope you're still good, hope you're still well, hope things are going well for you. Black lives still matter, that's not gonna change. I know I keep on saying it, but do I have to keep on reminding you? Apparently, yes, I do. Anyway, <laughs> hi. It's been a bit since I've sat down and talked. Kind of. I don't know. Una's Honest ended like a week ago, and that's a. that was a lot. I, you know, I'm good. I feel good. I'm still sad because there's certain things that I wish I had rewatched before it ended, but at the same time, I've moved forward. And by moving forward, I'm playing more D&D &D with some friends. <laughs> uh, so last time I drew a D&D &D character, uh, they were an ASMR and pretty badass and I love them to death. Uh, I decided that I didn't need to play a serious character, uh, and it's more fun to play the dumbass, although collectively I think our team has one brain cell, and it's usually shared between Jir or Joy, so that's a whole thing. I, <laughs> I went really hard for the stupid barbarian, but when I was making my character, uh, this was in the middle of my most, um, intense part of my Spongebob the Musical obsession, which is fine. I still adore that show. The obsession comes and goes in waves, so some days I'll be like, neat Sponge. Other days I'm like, okay, Sponge is great. And then other days I'll be like, neat Sponge. So that's a whole other thing. Hello, cat. Uh, <laughs> but, so as you can see, or maybe, I don't know if you can see, I'm, I'm recording this at 11.30 p.m. And as you can see in my screen, uh, that's about like an hour before this. So, <laughs> we'll see how that goes. But, I found out that there was such a thing as fish people, not triton, but like literal fish people, uh, that have like a really fucked up backstory, which made me love them even more. So I decided to be, uh, fuck, what is he called? It's fine, I'll insert it later. You're welcome. <laughs> But he's a fish man, and uh, all he does is talk to animals and tiny mushrooms, and he's just a complete dumbass. He's found his new goal. His original goal was to find the pieces of his best friend to fill the, s the rectangular shaped hole left in his heart, but... He kind of lost track of that, so now his main goal is to become friends with Jir. And I think that became like the party goal? So this is gonna be really fun. I'm really excited. I love this. My character is a complete nutter dumbass, and I love him. I have had so much fun the other night playing him, and even though I couldn't hit for shit, uh, we had like a whole side thing where we befriended tiny mushrooms and then got into really stupid shenanigans. Like, the original town we were in, I guess all the people there were kind of mildly speciesist, so the only people that they liked were dwarves and humans. So Jira's from that town and he is a human. And I, we're made up of a tiefling, a goblin, and fish guy. Uh, so <laughs> that was great, and we just continuously pissed off the governor. It was awesome. We didn't do it on purpose. <laughs> purpose. Uh, we sunk a couple of ships. I swam under and just kept on whittling holes into a thing for like a solid half hour. And yeah, now we made it to a new town, and the first thing we did was we're going to disguise ourselves as totally normal human beings by 
me picking up the goblin and putting him on my shoulders and wrapping a sheet around him. So now we are a perfectly normal human uh, sitting in a hot tub because my, my fish character can only be out of water every four hours. We're working around that. I appreciate uh, I appreciate my DM being so chill. Shout out to you. Uh, you're, 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 you're the best. <laughs> you're the best at, and I'm glad that you're putting up with my shit and also I appreciate the whole group putting up with my dumb shit. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it's just been a lot of fun. Uh, we'll send, I'll send like a couple of dumb fish pictures and yeah, I, I just like I think I kind of figured out what his character is going to be. Basically, that one episode of Spongebob where Squidward and- no, not Squidward, well Squidward's part of it, but Spongebob and Patrick get into a fight and then they're trying to be friends with Squidward. So uh, my, my character is just constantly like, friend. And yes, this is Patrick. <laughs> <laughs> I have been doing just like my dumb like almost sans voice the entire time that I'm playing him so like we all call Jir boss and it's kind of like uh well can you be my friend and then <laughs> he's almost like he's I, I love I love my character. He's like almost too innocent. He wants to kill things, but also just wants to be friends with everything. He wants to also be friends with every single inanimate object he can find. And in fact, when he found the tiny mushrooms, he's never been happier. And the fact that Jir took him along and is willing to take care of him is probably the happiest he's been the entire time even like with the Hydra. So that's a thing. Uh, yeah, I don't know how long this video will end up being. Like the drawing process took about an hour and a half. Thanks Kat. Uh, and uh, at this point, hopefully you'll see like how he looks. <laughs> and yes, also I was like, you know, into Steven Universe while I was creating this character. So I didn't entirely base the design on, or his shirt on, uh, Steven Universe. There's a little bit of Super Sea Star Savior. Thanks, bud. A little bit of Super Sea Star Savior in there. So, that's a thing. And, um, I named him Lapu Bit. Lapu comes from, like, a very obvious reference to the, uh, the tribe leader that killed Magellan, that defeated Magellan. I'm gonna say defeated because, you know, suck it Magellan. Uh, <laughs> there's a lot of stuff in history that I love talking about. Uh, I'm not saying the Lapu is an idiot. I mean, my character is an idiot. The Lapu Lapu was this really cool guy in history. And he was just like, well, these colonizers are going to try and colonize and destroy us. We don't want that. So the Spaniards totally like underestimated the uh, natives and the indigenous people and they tried to destroy them and that didn't happen because Lapu was just like, or Lapu Lapu was just like, <laughs> suck it. And I mean like the Spaniards were also like super weak from having been at sea for so long and they didn't have as many people. So they, they, they lost royally. And like, that's a whole, it's a whole thing. I think that's really, that's, that's it. I, I'm thinking of, uh, if you haven't seen my hump, ha, da, ha, da, Undertale, wow, there were like five different fandoms I almost said. If you haven't seen my Undertale video, at the end I mentioned that the next game that I'm going to be playing is Homestuck. I'm going to be recording that on Wednesday when it comes out because I have the day off. Yes. And hopefully I will be able to edit it that day so I can post it either that day or the next day. So that means there might, there probably won't be a Wednesday video, but there will probably be a Thanksgiving video. And by Thanksgiving, it's going to be Homestuck, which is ironic because, you know, <sighs> while I'm thankful for this game to finally come out, it has been seven years 
and the development has been in hell, so that's another thing. Won't talk about that, we'll talk about that when I get to Hive Swap Act 2. Alright, I think that's all that I have for this video. I hope you enjoy it. I had a lot of fun drawing him. I've been doodling him in my sketchbook and this is the first time I have like a full rendered picture of my dumb boy. So thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. If you haven't subscribed, click subscribe. I'm gonna keep on working on making speed paints. Hopefully I'll get back to doing my like quote unquote animated story times. I've gotten a little bit better. I know exactly how I want to do those now so it doesn't take nearly as long. It just takes some different processes. Well, we're getting there. We're almost done doing some good stuff and then I'm doing some dumb love stays. All right. I think I think that's that, that that's it. I'll see you. Okay, bye.